Okay, so from this side you can see yes the power on off button, power connected port, Wi-Fi on off button, WPS button, and here's the reset button. So from here you can see this is the WAN port used to connect to the modem and 4 LAN port can connect to 4 wired device like your computer, like TV box as well and this one is the USB port used to connect your USB printer or USB hard drive to use for sharing So here also we have another USB port used to connect USB printer as well or USB share drive Okay, so now we're going to use our handphone to set up the Wi-Fi router. So, just looking for D-Link QRS Mobile. Install this one. And after that, we're going to connect our Wi-Fi router Wi-Fi based on the configuration card here. So, just connect to the Wi-Fi. Yeah, now it shows connected. So we're going to launch these applications. Okay, here you can see the wizard will guide you to select the device and operation mode, configure your network and Wi-Fi, set device password, set up Wi-Fi firmware notifications, save the setting and share the Wi-Fi. And optional for register your device with my link. But this device does, doesn't come with my link. So we're going to start now. Okay, select operation mode. This device acts as a router. And next it. So, plug one end of your internet cable included with your device into the port label internet on your device. Plug the other end to your DSL modem or cable modem. Okay, so from here you can see, you can set up your 2.4 Wi-Fi settings. So here, just key in the Wi-Fi name. So like you can key in like DIR. Take it to two point four. Okay, password you also can modify it. One two three four five six seven eight. Okay, if not okay, just click on next. Now going to set your device password. So to, to secure your router as well, you can set any password of it. Okay, if you feel okay, just click on next. Okay, from here you can take a note. Setup complete already. They will tell you what's the things to set up. So you can see the mode is router mode. Wi-Fi network will be DIR882 by 4 Wi-Fi password. And this will, do, this will be the password and the device password as well. Okay, if okay, just click on next. Okay, so now we're going to connect the Wi-Fi. Just now we set up done. So from here you can see DIR882 2.4. Just connect it. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This is the password just now we set. Just connect it. Okay, now it's connected. So, we go back to the QRS mobile. You can see, congratulations, we set up done already. So from here, you can select either you want to share your Wi-Fi. So you can share your Wi-Fi to your family as well by your email address. So you can send an email to tell them why is the Wi-Fi name with the password. If finished, just click on finish. So now we are going to configure our D-Link Wi-Fi DIR882. So from here you can see there's a there's a dealing com Wi-Fi configuration card that is coming with the DIR882 packaging. So just use the card you can see what's the Wi-Fi name and Wi-Fi password. So just use the computer to connect to the Wi-Fi. So just select the Wi-Fi name, connect it, and type in the password. Okay, so from here you can see that's connected. So after that's connected. You just launch a browser. So from browser side, you can type in HTTP 
column slash slash d l i n k d link and router d link router and enter okay so from here you can see there's a welcome and they, there's a wizard to step by step guide you how to configure your new d link wi-fi router so from here you can see step one install device step two configure network and settings wi-fi settings step three set the router password okay so from here you can click on next so now it's detecting the internet connections just wait for a while okay so from here you can see what's the wi-fi network name wi-fi password so from from this column these two columns you can just key in your own wi-fi name and password just set up your own so for me i will set dir882 and Wi-Fi password just set uh, based on your own. You can set must 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 be content at least eight characters. So just set it one two three four five six seven eight. Okay. After that, just click on next. So from here, they will ask you to configure a device admin password. So this is the password to configure your router. So you you can set. By your own also by default there's no password so you have to set the password okay after set it done just click on next so from here you can see the summary of your settings the connection type dhcp that means you get a dynamic ip from your from your isp site so from here you can see what's the wi-fi network name you set up just now wi-fi password you set up just now and the device admin password you set up just now if everything okay, just click on next. Okay, congratulations. Your setup has been done. Now you can connect your Wi-Fi network by using your Wi-Fi network name just now and the password you created just now. Okay, after that, just click on finish. So your changes are being saved. Okay, wait for 25 seconds. Okay, so from here you can see your Wi-Fi network has been disconnected, so you won't have any, you are not connected to a network. So from here we can looking for the Wi-Fi. Okay. So just looking for the Wi-Fi network. Yeah, the Wi-Fi network is here. DIR882. So connect it. So type a network security password. Just key in the password just now you created. Just now I created 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So now we use this Wi Fi password to connect it. Just click on OK. OK. It's connected done. That means your Wi Fi name has been, Wi Fi name and Wi Fi password has been connected successfully. OK, thank you.